it bothers me when people bring up MLK because he's become so corporate yeah. and everyone just brings him up without knowing about him. One of the things that Martin Luther King did so very well was that he forced people to face the consequences of what they were putting forward. You want to be racist. You want to be for Jim Crow. You want to be for segregation. Okay. It's easy for you to do that from your living room. Now turn on your news and you see men and women in suits being attacked by dogs, being attacked by fire hoses and beaten by cops just so they could sit on the front of the bus. And now for a lot of people who were still racist, who were still had animus toward black people are watching this and it's going to be a lot harder to be like, I'm okay with this. I'm okay with human beings, even ones I regard as somehow bad or inferior, to be beaten and attacked by uh, trained dogs, and they're not doing anything in response. That strikes to, I think, a very basic nature of, especially American, like, okay, whatever you're for, I'm not for people getting beaten and attacked when they're not really doing anything. So I think uh, pacifism is something that's very easy to make fun of, but people don't uh, underestimate how powerful it is for someone to say, you can do what you want to me. I'm not going to fight you back. I just want to live peacefully and have the same rights as you. And to say, screw you, you should get beaten. It, it, that's a hard pill for a lot of people to swallow. So I think he was really, and Gandhi, of course, as well, uh, were excellent in that regard. There's a little bit of Machiavellianism to it. You know, they've both been beatified in regard as saints, but their strategy worked very, very well for their purposes. So I think uh, just all of us, when you see someone, you know, in this kind of Christian, you know, I know Iran obviously does not think very highly of Christianity, but if he's someone who's willing to, you know, take a punch and just say, you could do whatever you want to me, I'm not going to hurt somebody else, instinctively, uh, and maybe this is kind of a hack, most people want to side with that guy, step in between and be like, oh, okay, let's take a step back because whatever led to this is not tenable. We need to go back to the drawing board if the consequence is people are having uh, these as a result of, of my decisions and actions. So 